Hello everyone, my name is Robo and today we're going to be playing something that totally isn't a Dragon Ball Z knockoff game on the uh, Google Play Store. So this is, well I can't even remember what the hell it was called. The app wasn't called this when I downloaded it, but considering these kind of games usually get shut down pretty quick, I'm not surprised if this is like the 8th or ninth different name it's had, but this, uh, this is Kamehameha Warrior Z, I guess, or Kamehameha Z Warrior, one of the two. And as you can see, we've got not Goku, not Yamcha, and not Bulma, with uh, not Oolong and not Pua as our uh, as our loading screen, with something that totally doesn't say Dragon Ball on the side of this vehicle. I'm just going as guess. This isn't going to be something I'm going to be prolonging with. <laughs> you hillbilly. <laughs> All right, let's let's begin. Let's see what. Uh, this is all about. This looks familiar. I think I've seen a game like this before. That's pretty nice. Pretty nice animation. Let's see what this... Okay. That's not too bad. Yeah, continue my adventure. Hey, nothing like stealing le arts from legends. I'm pretty sure that's legends art. I don't think that's Dokkan art. But it's certainly some stolen artwork. <laughs> All right, let's see. This is pretty cool. This does look pretty cool. I'll give it that. I have seen something like this. I think I've seen a Pokemon game like this as well, actually. So uh, I'll give it. I'll give it credit. It's cool. It's cool to look at, but like I say you, you're stealing art. You know, if they, <laughs> if they catch you doing this, you're gonna get in um, quite a bit of trouble. Also, why is Tien wearing that? That's not what he's wearing on the in-game model. You can't do that. I can only suspend disbelief so much. Like, why has he got that? But then these two have got sort of artwork that matches their model. That's weird. This is a testament to how good some of the art in Legends is. Like, Legends has Dokkan B in general on card artwork. Like, it looks fantastic in Legends. Legend of Legends just isn't my game. It looks nice, but I just, I'm just i just not that good at it. And there's no point, like, this is playing itself on auto. Can I put it on time? I can, okay. Oh, I can't yet. Okay. Oh, there's actually an idle thing while you're in the menus as well. That's kind of cool. All right, we're trying to botch stealing manga artwork as well now. There's just no level that you won't stoop to, is there? Also, Bulma. Wrong artwork again. That looks like that might actually be from the Dokkan World Tournament card of her. All right, we're getting gems and rewards. No, I want to claim the rest of my... Why can't I claim on the rest of my jewel things? My diamonds. Ah, yes, all these different types. Very, um, <laughs> explanatory. What the fuck's this? What's this? Why have I got a wedge of cheese in the top corner? Are we playing Trivial Pursuit now? Oh, okay, so there's faction bonuses. To be fair, there seems some cool mechanics in here. It's just a shame that you've stolen Dragon Ball Z artwork and shit. I think we're going to get a spank in here, boys, because um, Krillin's already... I mean, Krillin's usually dead, but... Oh, okay. Ooh, yeah, we're dead. Damn, Tien. Tien carry in here. Tien is just the carry of the team, but he is leveled up. Why do I have... To, I'm just going to keep dying. Look, I have level ones. Can I go times two? No. What is this proving apart from the fact that Krillin dies? And Goku dies with him, I guess. Heal Tien. Or power up Tien. So my strategy is Bulma helps him get his ultimate gauge and then he just blows him away. I'm not buying shit. Fuck off. 
Well, I say, the mechanics of this are quite cool, and to be honest, if this wasn't a game... I mean, this, this is not something I'd recommend you even downloading, full stop, people. Like, de devs like this, it's not worth, um, it's not worth your time doing it. It'll probably be deleted within a few days, anyway. Or, it'll be renamed. They'll, like, shut it down, but then rename it as something else and put it back on the store. Again, more Legends artwork. You're just stealing. And this isn't even subtle stealing. This isn't like stealing something off Deviant Art. This is just stealing off of an official Dragon Ball game. Hey, we can level up Piccolo to level. Level. Oh, stop bringing up screens. How many diamonds have I got? 90. I'm thinking that's not going to be enough to summon when I eventually can summon. Assuming that I can't... I want to deploy him. Go on. Why can't I upgrade my front line? My front line is getting bitch slapped here, and they just have to stand there and take it. Alright, Piccolo, what can you do? <laughs> I'm sure Piccolo's special beam cannon there would have been good, but Tien just went and blew the rest of them away before they could prove it. Why is that only one battle? That, that's weird. Usually most of these things have like three. You're just making me play through the story. This isn't even a tutorial at this point. You're just making me play the story and upgrade things. That's not a tutorial. This tutorial is about as in-depth as Pokemon Red's tutorial. Which was, here's a Pokemon. Fuck off. <laughs> To be honest, this is cool. I, I I am actually enjoying this. I just have a problem when they blatantly stolen artwork and there's no way that they've got any sort of rights to make this. But this this is cool. But make just make a generic game. There's plenty of ones on the store that people buy or don't buy. They download and play that are a similar fashion. This just do that. You clearly got some decent ideas. It would be, I mean, it would be nice for a new Dragon Ball game to uh, appear on the App Store, but obviously if you've watched my channel enough, you know I'm looking for a Hero Coliseum app game. But nobody's done it. I, ne I need somebody to do at least a Hero Coliseum-esque app game. Like, just, just a game with the same sort of theme. It doesn't have to be Dragon Ball related, just give me a, an app game that's like it. All right, we're blowing stuff away now because we've got super over-leveled things in the back row. That's some really cool... It's cool artwork. To be fair, they're choosing cool artwork to steal. I don't know how much credit they deserve for that, but... Oh, look, Krillin's dead. What a surprise. Why can I not upgrade the other people so they don't die in three seconds? Would it just be too easy, then? Oh, I think it's actually freed me. But it's actually not told me how to do much at all, to be honest. City, okay. Shop. I can't go in the shop until I've cleared more of the game. Or Capsule Corp. Or Guild. I can't do anything. Why? I can level. Ah, can I? Can I cheat to go to? Oh, hello. All right. So I only I have none of them for friend heroes. I need twenty seven hundred diamonds to to summon, and I get three SSRs. Who can I get? My wish list. Recruit 60 more times to unlock wish list. So if I do 60... If I draw 60 cards, I get an SSR. What? What kind of fucking shit system is this? What's this? Spend 1,000 points to obtain... It's okay, okay, so how much does this cost? $15! Fuck off! <laughs> Month pass, 15. 
Oh, you reach cumulative to thirty dollars cumulative. How much? Oh, holy shit, sticks! Look at all this. Look at that. What? If you spend money on this game, you're. I mean, I don't want to insult you, but you are kind of dumb. <laughs> Giving money to devs like this, you're you're literally just pissing your money away. Like you might as well just burn it. You might as well just throw it on a fire and burn it, because it'll have as much value. Like seriously. This is cool. This is cool. Don't don't get into it. Don't for the love of God, do not link your email accounts or anything like that to that. Just log in as a guest if you want to try it out and look for yourself. It's a fun little thing, but I wouldn't advise it because I don't see it lasting. Games like this are kind of, not in this exact sort of format, but the idea of taking the Dragon Ball name or Pokemon or Digimon, any of them, and making a game, there are a dime a dozen. Plenty of devs do them. Usually they're shit. This one isn't, but like I'd rather them go and put their efforts into making a good uh, app game that isn't full of stolen assets. But anyway, thank you for watching. That's some fight. I think that's some fighters artwork there isn't it in there as well so we've now stolen from three of the major dragon ball games hope you've enjoyed it like i say don't get into this i honestly don't even know how safe this app is which is why i've sort of done done it the way i have on a computer that i really don't uh, use anymore <laughs> just in case but uh don't get into it and for the love of god if you do play it don't spend money on it please don't put any of your money into this game Put it literally anywhere else to get some value out of it. But anyway, thank you all again for watching, and I'll see you next time.